Currently, litigation finance or third-party legal funding is illegal under Irish law. This dates back to the Maintenance and Embracery Act of 1634, which was last retained by the Statute Law Revision Act of 2007. Additionally, this was reaffirmed in the Persona case. There, the Irish Supreme Court was asked to consider the legality of litigation finance. The five-judge panel ruled 4-1 to one against litigation finance legality. However, in doing so, the Supreme Court stressed that it may be appropriate to have a modern law permitting litigation finance and only ruled as such because this was a matter of policy and not a matter for the courts. Contrary to the current legislation and court cases, the general view in Ireland, held by a number of commercial litigation and dispute resolution practitioners, is that a reform, subject to appropriate criteria and parameters is needed and very badly wanted. The costs of running a commercial case have grown increasingly expensive over the last couple of years and have precluded some claimants from vindicating their rights. Because of this, justice is being hampered. Whether a change happens remains to be seen. As Brexit continues to dominate, the Irish government has stated that 45 laws would need to be passed in the event of a no deal. Thus, there is an urgent need in the for legislative reform in Ireland. Due to this and according to the Bar of Ireland, the Law Society and the wider legal community, it would not be a surprise or an unwelcome development if legislation to allow litigation finance to penetrate their country.